Hey guys, Assalamu alaikum. Welcome back to my channel and today we are going to learn combo box. That what is combo box and how we can create a combo box in PyCharm by using TK Enter. So combo box in TK Enter is a basically is a drop down list which contains many items and but show one item at a time. And uh, basically it's it's a combination of uh, data uh, entry field and uh, uh, list box and uh, uh, for a combo box to create in a window we have to use the TTK class TTK class of the TK inter uh, library and uh, basically a combo box is uh, uh, is a class of TTK module from the TK inter library and TTK module uh, is used for styling the widgets so um, for we have to import the TTK module uh, if we want to create our combo box and uh, and you can see this e uh, example actually this is uh, an example of the combo box and this is a drop down list when you click on the drop down uh, icon a list of the different items uh, shown in the picture so we have to create a combo box like this so be with me and uh, don't miss uh, don't forget to subscribe my channel and hit the bell icon for more videos and like my videos if you like it so uh, support my channel so let's get started so here we are in our PyCharm editor and let's create uh, our combo box first of all we have to uh, import the TK enter from TK enter import Tarek. and now I have already told you that we have to import uh, TTK so from TK enter import TTK you can see this this is the TTK module and now we have to create our window and I'm naming this window as root root is equals to TK and now I am giving the title here like root dot title and giving here like combo box okay now I'm gonna set the geometry 200 by 200 and now I am going to uh, define the course uh, actually and I'm going to add in the uh, drop down list and we are adding this in a list so I'm giving my first item Java and then Python and then C and then C++ and so I'm giving a label here like L1 is equals to label and uh, now I'm uh, giving the window name root and giving the text here like uh, select your favorite language and now place that label in a grid so right here like l1 dot grid and just place here like zero row I want to place that on the zero row and the zeroth column to zero and now I am uh, creating a combo box finally CMB is the name of my combo box and here we have to use our TTK module like combo box sorry I think yes for the capital C and now I am giving the uh, window like root and then value is equals to this course this course would be our value here so I'm giving here like course and giving the width here width is equals to 10 so now also place that uh, combo box in a grid dot grid and place it on the uh, row second second row and second column okay and uh, now just uh, right here 
True dot main loop. Okay, and just run this program and check whether it's running or not. Okay, yes, it is running, but uh, we have to set the grid here and uh, just row one and column zero. And now I'll run this and check it again. Yes, now it is looking a perfect look and uh, just click on it and you can see this our list is added here and the drop down when we clicked on drop down our list is uh, ready to select and like I've select Python and Python is here I've selected Java so Java and here we can add uh, another uh, uh, module or an other function here like uh, if I'm right here I think you're like cmb dot current current means that which index do you want to show in your data entry let me show you I, I want to show you I want to show the uh, uh, item on the zero index in the combo box you can see this Java is at the zeroth index so Java is displaying here if I click here like Python now whenever I will run this program so Java will be uh, showing here and uh, if I change this to 2 so so you can see this th at the second index the C language is at the second index so C is going to be um, so C is showing here by uh, so uh, this is how you can change uh, the index here but keep uh, in mind that the index should be uh, uh, even uh, less than or equal to the items in the list it should not exceed this limit otherwise it will give you an error and we can also check this like I'm giving here like 5 and uh, yes it is giving an error index 5 out of range because we have given just 4 elements and like 0 1 2 and 3 so total index are 3 here but uh, I'm giving here fifth index so fifth index it is obviously is out of range hope you understand this lecture and you can add uh, other items and other uh, uh, elements to your combo box or list uh, uh, you can even add a uh, month months names in your combo box with different vegetable names or whatever you want so okay please subscribe my channel and hit the bell icon for more videos and like my videos if you like it so take care bye bye and Allah Hafiz